Hammer time. Through those corners. Keith Gable. Next up we have Jirumu Narita from Japan, from Osaka. Got some top tens last year, a ninth, a seventh, and a ninth, and two snowboard crosses and a bank slalom and woke up. We've got Owen Pick. Owen Pick from Great Britain, 25 years of age. He's an athlete and a veteran. Nice clean turn, a little bit of a spray there at the end of the turn. Not dumping too much speed. We've got Matty Sirhamari from Finland. 30 years of age, this is Matty Sirhamari. Yeah, that was incredible. Uh, my first one was okay. Second one, I got up into first. Um, and I thought the one was pretty sketchy. And then the second one, uh, the last run, Matty just beat me, pumped, pit me here. And uh, But yeah, it's a fun course and super wild in there. Well, pretty good. I, feel, <laughs> I can say I feel pretty good. This, this was like, uh, pretty much like, well, kind of uh, second uh, sport to me, like Pakistan, but I was surprised that I uh, came out with the gold medal with because it was so tight race and uh, guys were putting like so good times and the course was freaking long <laughs> and I was in like uh, yesterday in the training I was like I, I can't make it because, <laughs> because in the lower shakes and I, I was feeling like okay I'm going to be netting because I can't stand anymore. <laughs> And then we've got Reinhold Shep from Austria. Reinhold got second place in two World Cups. In a snowboard cross last year. And he got... Oh, nice ride. Bluebird, sunny skies, and a great course prepared by the Telus Park crew. We have our athletes, the very most talented, skilled pair of snowboard racers in the world, right here. We just had Mike Boltry from the Netherlands go down. Now we have Chris Voss. Looking very fast from the nether. It's great.
great again uh, to be on the podium and <laughs> it was really close because also Mark Mann has good times and it was only three, three uh, tenths of a second and it was pretty hard to drive from top to bottom and I'm so lucky that I can get to it. So. I didn't want to charge too hard, I just wanted to, to, to stay upright and just uh, link all the berms together as best I could and then just really pin it down on the bottom where I felt really comfortable. And uh, yeah, the top section, it was just trying to hang on. <laughs> yeah, uh, I, uh, I came here to uh, defend uh, the gold medal, of course, but uh, I knew uh, the guys are uh, really uh, charging and uh, yeah, in the border cross um, it was really tight and uh, here just a little bit more my my place, uh, more carving, uh, uh, yeah, carving in here. Uh, that's uh, that's where I put the most chains on. Uh, but uh, yeah, it happened twice uh, again. So yeah, I'm uh, really excited. Yeah, first one I thought uh, was pretty sketchy. I thought I couldn't do better, but the course was uh, the most fresh, uh, and uh, I had a pretty fast run though. And the second run, uh, I thought it was faster, but it was a little bit slower. Um, and uh, I just threw every, everything on the third run and uh, that didn't happen but the first one was uh, good enough so I'm uh, very happy. Yeah. <laughs> Next up, Joni Badenhorst from Australia, born in South Africa but competes for Australia. Nice turns. Nice turns by Joni Badenhorst. She is ripping this course apart. Wow, Joni Badenhorst looking. Big turns. Very nice riding by 33 year old Bruno. That's the jack. <laughs> From Croatia. Yeah. Wait, who's this on court? This is the new category? Next up, we have Bibian Mentel. She won a gold medal at the Paralympic Games when the sport made its debut at Sochi. And she's a smooth rider, working the turns nicely here. This is Bibian. Um, it was really, really difficult. I had to put it all out there and it's not easy with the snow. Hotspot's always difficult, no matter like if you're like fully abled or part of the para, it's just really difficult. But I think that we, we pulled it off today. I'm really, really excited and happy. It was fun. Yeah, yeah it was pretty sketchy, bumpy, but it was fun. It feels a little bit like free riding. So. Oh, awesome. I'm so happy that it worked out. Like, after my first run, I got really, really scared. Lisa was like half a second before me, and I was like, I really need to step up my game because, wow, she's fast. So, um, I did in the second run. Luckily, I took some time off my first run. I was really stoked about that. Um, and yeah, the weather held out fine. The course was really, really awesome. So, I'd like to thank all the crew and all the coaches who've been shoveling out there. like for a million hours. Uh, it was a great race and I'm really, really stoked. We've got Amy Purdy on course, 37 years old from Las Vegas, Nevada. She's an athlete, an author, a business person, a designer, a motivational speaker. She won the bronze medal at the 2014 Paralympic Winter Games in Sochi. 
This is Amy Purdy. This is Cecile Hernandez Cervelo, 42 years old, from Perpignan, France. She's a BMXer, a mountain biker, and obviously a very talented snowboarder. Look at her rip! This is Cecile Hernandez! That turn on the heel side, just letting her rip. We've got our next athlete on course for the United States of America. 21 year old Brenna Huckabee from Baton Rouge, Louisiana. Absolutely ripping here. Brenna Huckabee flying down this corner. I laid one down my first run. So my last two, I was like, how fast can I make this baby? And second run didn't go as planned, but uh, third run, I stuck it and stayed up. Yeah, it's definitely a tough course yesterday. I did not land in a single training run, so I came in with very low expectations, and today was much better, much better berms. Because she never surrenders. I love that. She lost her leg in a motorcycle accident. And here she is competing at the Para World Championship. This is Ben Moore from Great Britain, and look at him go! All right, we got Michael Miner. Michael Miner is a skateboarder as well from Scranton, Pennsylvania. He's really letting her rip here. Just hammering. Got that U.S. jersey on. He's getting low. And We've got Maxime Montaglioni, Montaglioni, from France, 27 years old. 